we we have made that mistake and i will not want them to make that mistake investing in nigeria is not it really yes if you were some my people i agree to nice boy italian davido at this very moment now then i will this our senior man i can get one or two things now when they want to tell us so be you badest who the brit because when we came mm -hmm. when we came here we were not having the opportunity you guys that are coming now are having. When we came, mm -hmm. we were waiting for the government to pass a law okay. for us to have a, a permit to stay. Okay. But you guys, when you guys are coming in, mm -hmm. they, they are just giving you permit to stay. Mm -hmm. With you, whether, whether you go to commission mm. or you don't go to commission, mm. you guys get the permit to stay. I would say you, you get it on a platter of gold. We, like me, I stayed six years before I could get a permit to stay in this country. Okay. So, what I will advise to you guys that are just coming out, because getting a stay, that is the paramount thing in abroad. When you have the papers to be able to work, you'll be able to plan. You know that six years I told you, is just like a waste, because I could not do anything though i was trying to make ends meet but it's not like when you are legit you know when you are legit you can do everything so i would advise guys that are just coming in now when you have the documents try as much as possible to get work with it you understand you you try and get yourself employed with the documents so when you get yourself employed before you work one year, two years, they will definitely give you uh, a permanent working permit. So, sir, like how long have you been here, sir? I'm almost 20 years now. 20 years? Yes. Okay, fine. So, sir, in your 20 years of your life being here, mm -hmm. like, um, what are those things that you did that took you to the level you are now? Well, I will tell you, I've always been working. Okay. I've always been working, all these 20 years I'm telling you, I've always been working in the night and in the day. I was working 18 hours every day, Monday to Sunday. For these 20 years? Yes. I was working Monday to Sunday, working in the night and in the day. So, in Europe, you just have to work. Because if you don't work, only one job Cannot, cannot sustain you to take care of your guys at home. You understand? And sustain yourself here to, to stay well, to be a big boy that you want to be. So you understand? So you, you just have to hustle. So, but our guys now, they, they don't want to hustle. They always want to, they always want quick money. And there's no quick money in Europe. There's no quick money here, except you want to go into jail. You understand? There are quick money. I would say there are quick money, but it is quick to jail. She understand? So, so many of our guys that are just coming in, they go into box and they end up in jail. So, the document they gave them will now be destroyed. Because when you go to jail, you can't maintain that document again. So, I would advise guys to put their head down. We all know where we are coming from. She understand? Africa... Africa is not easy. That's why we are all jetting out to look for greener pastors. But when we get to greener pastors, we should always try and make the, the pastors green so that we can um, take something back home. Hey, Glesa. So, sir, yeah. let's talk about this investment aspect. Like, I've talked with several people, but there, there, are, there are some set of people who are kind of, like, being scared, like, to invest in this environment, like... Some say they prefer back home, like they don't feel that comfortable to invest here. So you not being here for the past 20 years. So like sure. what advice would you give about the investment aspect? Okay, yeah. I will tell guys who want to listen. We we have made that mistake. And I will not want them to make that mistake. Investing in Nigeria is not it. Really? Yes. If you are able to get an apartment here, mm -hmm. if you face the apartment, you, you, you just face it and be paying the, mor the mortgage. Mm -hmm. 
By the time you know it, if I had taken an apartment since I got back, by now I should have finished paying it. Mm -hmm. If that, that time I started working, mm -hmm. that I got an apartment, mm -hmm. I would have finished paying it. Mm -hmm trying to do things in Nigeria, 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 Nigeria. Mm -hmm. We are trying to build us, we want mm. to do this, we want mm. to do that. Mm. That we are not going to stay. Like me now, I think I've, the last time I've been to Nigeria is since 2018. Mm. So the house I have there, what is happening to it? Eh? You, you look at it. But if I have an apartment here, look mm. at what what rent is saying now mm. that I have an apartment, I put people in inside. You know how much I'll be, I'll be, I'll be cashing out. So I would advise guys when you have the opportunity, when you have a job that they give you a fixed job, that you have a fixed contract, a life contract. The best thing for you is to look for a house to buy, buy an apartment. And start paying the mortgage. Don't don't say because you have an apartment that you don't want to pay. Because when you don't pay the mortgage, you can stay there two, three years, four years. If you are not paying, the banks will not come for you. But they will still they will still get you out of the house at the long run. But if you are paying before you know it, because if you are paying mortgage, it's like you are paying rent. It's even cheaper if you are paying mortgage than paying rent. Do you understand? I'm feeling you, sir. Mm. I can resolve it. So, sir, tell me now. So, for you now, do you think it's more preferable to buy an apartment or to rent an apartment? It's more preferable if you have the opportunity mm -hmm. buy an apartment. It's the best. It's the best. It's the best. Okay. It's the best. So, is there any kind of uh, negative effect that you know that come with this buying of an apartment? There's no negative effect there. Okay, let's say what Just if... Face, if it is the only negative effect is mm -hmm. if you are not paying the, the mortgage. Mm -hmm. And if you, if you decide not to be paying mortgage, but you'll be paying rent if you are living in a, in a rented apartment. Mm -hmm. That is the mistake most people do. They don't want to pay mortgage, but they pay rent where they are staying. If you are paying mortgage, you are saving your money. If you are paying rent, you are, you are throwing it away. We have done all these mistakes. So it is better for them to, to, to try and tap into this that I'm saying. So for you now, like uh, investing in Nigeria, now, like you see it as a sort of kind of like waste or what? So, me, I, I don't know. For me, mm. I've, I've zero my mind in investing in Nigeria. Uh, no, no. Uh, what is there in Nigeria? This Nigeria that they are doing all this mm. waste. We see what they are doing now. Mm. Eh? You go and put your money and lock it down there. The, the government will come with a policy that will destroy everything. That your money will go into drain. Mm. Uh, we have invested in Nigeria before. We have invested in all age. I've mm -hmm. invested in so many things in Nigeria before. Did but you it's make, not working. Did you make profit out no, of it? No, no, no. I even brought people inside that we, we end up quarreling over mm. it. We sold everything, all the all the truck and everything that we got there. Mm. So it does not work. So mm. just Nigerian people, they are the ones that can do business with themselves. Okay. Do you understand? If mm. you come from outside to come and do business there, mm. they are going to frustrate you. Ah. Yes, yes, yes. They are going to frustrate you if you are not there. I have friends that are invested. Some even decided to go and stay. They, when they went to go and stay, that mm. is when they are able to, to mm -hmm. make something out of it. Mm -hmm. If you are not there, you are zero. So you are kind of like talking, it is more better if you are going to relocate, like totally, like you are going to be there to <laughs> investigate your business. Exactly. Okay. That you are going to be there. And you have to, when you are going to be there, so you have to mm. be very, very vigilant. Mm. Because... Mm. Many, many things. Many things. Okay. Yeah, yeah, like, <laughs> what do you think is the tips like to to keep marriage going, sir? To keep marriage going mm -hmm. in, in the Western world. Mm -hmm. Tips to spice up <laughs> Europe <laughs> marriage. Europe marriage. Yes, sir. <laughs> Man, you just have to be a Dundee United. Ah. Yes. For you to be able to make marriage in Europe, you just have to be. You don't have to be the kind of Nigerian man mm. that you are. You have to become an European mm. to make your marriage work in Europe. Uh, Me, I was once married. Okay. I was trying to do things like a Nigerian man, mm -hmm. but that kind of a tradition or African uh, me, Nigerian mentality, uh, like uh, that you are a Nigerian, mm -hmm. that you have to do things mm -hmm. like a man, do mm -hmm. everything. Mm -hmm. you know? mm -hmm. It does not work like that. Uh, you just have to let them 
do what they want to do. Mm -hmm. You just they be be behind them. Mm -hmm. You say you have to be like a don't you mean say like you need to bring yourself lower to the woman? Yes, that is it. That is just it. If you want to claim all the rights, mm -hmm. uh, you are you are going to get into so much trouble. Mm -hmm. So it is better for you to just you let things slide. So many say uh, mainly the man go they listen to the woman more. Yes, now you have to listen more. Ah, uh, but some people they prefer to go to Nigeria. Like you say, say they more okay to go to Nigeria. Like one minute more, sir. To to marry, to get a wife. So say no, good no, men not there. No, no. Me, I I will not tell you to do that mm -hmm. because the woman you want to go and bring in Nigeria. Mm. Sorry to say, mm -hmm. you you hardly know the woman. Mm. You go there. Two weeks, one month, mm. you are seeing the woman. Mm. That is not it. We have seen so many women that they brought from Nigeria. Mm -hmm. They start misbehaving. Uh, so, understand. so even to go bring, come here, you know, they are advisable also. Mm. It is better for you to take a woman here uh, that you know you are already in the system together. Mm. She understands. But some of them, they complain, say the woman where they are not get character. I, uh, me, I don't know. Okay, okay. I don't know. Okay. So, so I just give your life advice to the youth. Life advice. In general. Uh, be yourself. Okay. Be yourself, I will say again. Mm -hmm. And be yourself. Thank you so much. I appreciate you, sir. No problem. Thank you so much. Take Peace. Care.